Now, another big news, the Secretary General of the Influential Muslim World League, Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdul Karim Al Issa, has kicked off his six-day visit to India. He attended an event by National Security Advisor Ji Dovul at the India Islamic Cultural Center in New Delhi. He praised India's unity and sense of national pride of the Indian Muslim community. Alisa acknowledged India's contribution to humanity, adding that the Indian Muslim is proud of the constitution. He said that India and Muslim World League have a common objective of coexisting peacefully together while praising India's great model for coexistence and execution. NSA Doval also conveyed a message of peace and harmony. Doval further said that India has successfully managed to provide space for all its citizens, regardless of their religious, ethnic and cultural identities. <coughs> While adding that the Indian Muslim population is almost equal to the combined population of the 33 member countries of the Organization of Islamic Cooperation. Dr. Mohammed bin Abdul Karim Al Issa also met with Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Indian External Affairs Minister Dr. S. J. Shankar. He is also expected to meet with President Draupadi Murmu. During his visit to India, he will hold meetings with senior Islamic religious leaders and religious leaders of different faiths as well. However, an important part of his engagement will be a visit to the historic Jama Masjid for Friday prayers. The Islamic scholar is also slated to visit the iconic Taj Mahal in Agra during his trip. Al Isa is considered an influential preacher wielding influence on the Muslim community worldwide, particularly for his progressive and pro-reform positions. Al Issa is regarded as one of the strongest global voices on moderate Islam from Saudi Arabia. The Islamic scholar is known for promoting interfaith dialogue and espousing world peace. Before being appointed as the Muslim League chief, Al Issa served as the Minister of Justice in the Saudi Arabian cabinet. <laughs> 